Hi, Leo. Welcome to your um, weekly forecast. This is only for your finances and career, okay? Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Hmm. Looks like there will be an offer that will finally be coming your way. Some of you will be receiving a new job offer. Um, I'm also picking up something like a resolution. Um, some of you will be moving to a new place or that you'll be um, buying a new house or moving to a new house or a new company. All right, there is an earth sign that you will be um, contacting re with regards to a house mortgage, house sale, or something like that. All right. Seems like this the person that's been like um, managing your papers or your transactions with the bank. Some of you will also be re uh, renewing your lease. I feel like it's the, uh, you know, the right thing to do. You're also into sales. You will be closing a deal that's uh, around $30,000. Or 30000 All right. Now, this week you will be signing a new contract. Some of you will be receiving new job offer or you will be moving to a new department or a new team. Some of you will also be moving to a new building or a new place or you'll be buying a new house or selling off your property during this week. So altogether, I don't really see much dramas or problems. Okay. <clears throat> It looks like there are some things that you're so afraid or you're so anxious about, but it will be coming at the right time, especially the um, on Tuesday. All right. Now, you're so worried about your job. You're so worried about whether this is going to be taking off or you can do this or you can handle it or you can, you know, like be successful in uh, delivering it. You just need to be a little bit more confident okay be very careful with someone who's an older air sign that will be betraying you um ooh. for some leas out there who's been like having an affair with their co-workers be very careful because there is someone is an older air sign that will be not really attacking but more of confronting you so be very careful Otherwise, the communications and correspondences when it comes to your work will be very smooth during this week, and you will also be very happy. And I also feel like you have to attend or, yeah, you, you will be attending a training, exercise, seminars, conferences, exhibitions as well. Especially that there is something that you are planning to go to around the month of October. All right. And you want to finish off whatever it is that you are trying to finish off and you are preparing for like a a week break, okay, or like a holiday. Um, there's something that you're just trying to finish off or that you're just trying to, you know, to deliver and you just want to take some rest because you're so tired, you're so preoccupied and it's like you're so, you know, a little bit stumped with your work so you want to take a break um, just to rest and recuperate 
<clears throat> now, when it comes to your other aspects of your finances, if some of you are not so confident about achieving or delivering this um, this project or job that you're currently handling, especially if you're into project management, definitely you will be making it through. All right. I just feel like you need to be a little bit more practical. Some of you need to move to a new place or a new house for you to invite the new changes that you are, you know, trying to manifest that you're also trying to mold. All right. Because I feel like wherever you are right now, that house, it has like a very bad energy. It's been affecting your luck right now and your prosperity. So if you will be moving to a new place or a new house or a new room or whatever it is, I feel like you will be, um, your luck will be changing. Some of you will also be preparing for your wedding or you want to save up for your you know, you want to save up for for your um, engagement or for your wedding. I feel like some of you wants to get married around the month of August or next year. And you want to save up more. Some of you are also planning to either buy a house, rent a house, lease, or sell off their properties. Especially if you're involved with an earth sign. Okay. Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. You will also start distributing some of the things that you don't really want. So you will be decluttering and you will be like uh, removing some of the old things that you no longer need, but other people need it. So just for you to free up some space, you will be discarding some of the things that you no longer need. I feel like some of your unwanted gifts that you've been you know, hiding inside a closet and right now you just want to free up some space so that you can convert it into something else or something more useful so you will be giving it to someone else or to some other people some of you will also try Ooh, some of you have some talents in writing or music writing or composing or something like that some of you are also into writing a diary, okay? Uh, especially if you have moon in uh, air sign, moon in air elements like Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Some of you will be writing, pouring your heart out. Well, I feel like some of you will be... Um, learning how to compose or going back to writing or you will be inspired because there are some new things that will be taking place finally in your life and you feel like i'm a little bit inspired okay uh, some of you will also start working on your yoga body and some of you will also start stretching those muscles you know for you to shape up those fats into muscles and hmm looks like you really have this burning desire to be with this person mm -mm -mm. the only thing here is i feel like there will be some issues with a with a family or there 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 will be some issues with the family of this person so this is the only thing that you are trying to prepare for. But financially, I feel like the two of you are well kept. The two of you are well financed, established, or the two of you are trying to make a lot of plans of moving in together. Let's get married to this and that. Let's save up for this. You know, um, there will be some plans. So I feel like you will have enough money for that. All right. Just be a little bit more practical if you really want to. Let's take a look at your Oracle cards. Nurture yourself, success, allow yourself to receive, recognition, writer's group, prosperity, let go, classes, 
By the way, some other people are asking if I'm Russian. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. Definitely. <laughs> All right. Um, okay. Nurture yourself. Investing time in self-care now will yield more energy for you later. Now, success. Congratulations. You did it. Allow yourself to receive, open your arms to welcome the blessings and answer prayers that God is sending to you. Recognition you and your accomplishments are re um, receiving appreciation and honors. Ooh, writer's group, it's really here. Create a joint writer's group to gain inspiration, friendship, and support. Um, prosperity, your actions have resulted in incoming abundance. Let go. Release the desire to control their situation and live it up to God's infinite wisdom to resolve everything beautifully. Classes, learning, and teaching are part of your higher calling. Some of you needs to consider this. Have confidence in your creations. Trust in the power of God's creativity, which is being manifested through you. Gratitude, you attract more blessings when you appreciate your current blessings. Agent or manager, your work expands its reach as your partner with a professional who can help you. Vulnerability, listen to your vulnerable feelings as they contain wisdom and inspiration and then pray for strength to focus on your priorities no matter what. For you to go back to your usual routine and I feel like you just need to get some rest because some of you are really, really burned out already. Okay, it's hard to function when you're feeling so burned out. Okay, that that happens to me all the time. Anyway, that's it for you for this week, Leo. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone and live the calls, just go visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.